okay now uh, let's uh, discuss about when a molecule absorbs light energy what happens these are the different energy levels as 0 as 1 as 2 as it is the ground state if a light of blue wavelength is given electron goes up to as 2 state when it comes back releases its energy in the form of heat when we give red light it just reaches to as one state because wavelength of the red light is more than the blue light and wavelength is inversely proportional to energy that's why red has less energy compared to blue that is just reaches to as one state from S1, when electron comes back to ground state, it releases its energy in the form of light, which is known as fluorescence. Or it may emit some amount of heat and stays in a matter stable state, which is known as triplet state. In triplet state, when electron comes back to the ground state, it releases its energy in the form of light which is known as phosphorescence so the difference between phosphorescence and fluorescence is in fluorescence emission of light is quick but in phosphorescence it is a delayed emission of light triplet state is that state as a biology student you should understand that triplet state and singlet state electron stays more in the triplet state that's why molecule has a chance to talk to the electron or we can say in in other terms that at this state electron can participate in a reaction suppose a molecule releases electron it becomes a plus release of electron that is oxidation suppose this electron is accepted by b then b will become b minus and this process is reduction so in this reactions what we observe oxidation and reductions now this is a redox reaction and that is happening only because triplet state give electrons to, to, to talk about to other molecules, they share thoughts, then reaction takes place, then uh, chemical reaction uh, takes place which is powered by light and which is known as photochemical reaction. This, this term is very important, please remember that. Now, how energy is transferred to a reaction center during photosynthesis? These are the different light harvesting complexes and this is the reaction center. Light harvesting complex that includes pigments, proteins, keratinides, chlorophyll molecules, so many things. And now, how energy is transferred? This is an important slide. Now, how from this energy electron is released from the reaction center as we discussed in the earlier slide. Now, light energy is absorbed by the pigment molecules. It resonates, this pigment molecule resonates and transfers energy nearly 90% to the reaction center and from here electron is released as we discussed in the previous slide and it is accepted by an acceptor and this reaction is called photochemical reaction 